We'll guide you through how to enable and use Steam Family. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. This is super useful to go and do, as it means you can easily go and share games, amongst other things with other household members. So let's go and get started. First of all, you need to go and have the people who you want to go and add to your Steam Family added as friends on Steam. To do that, go to the top left of Steam and click on Friends, and you can go and click on Add a Friend if you haven't already added them. I already have. Then all you need to do is go to the top right and click on the manage account button and you want to go down and click on store preferences and come over to the left and you need to go and select family management just like so. And then what we can do is start creating a family. So you can click and create a family. You can then go and give it a name and you can go and hit create over to the right. Then what we can do is start inviting members. So I'll click invite a member and you can then choose from your friends list who you want to go and add. So I'll go and add this person here and I want to invite them as an adult and I'll press invite again and they're then going to go and be sent an invite. The family member you invite will go and get a notification if they click on the bell icon in the top right and they can see they've been sent an invite. So they can go and click on it and they can then go and accept it. You can see this family member has now gone and accepted the invite. After they've done that, you can then go and start sharing Steam libraries. So if you click on the library at the top, you'll go and see the included games. You can also go and click on requests um, to go and purchase an access request from children, which they can go and make. So in this case, I haven't actually invited any children members yet. I've only invited adults. And when you invite an account as a child and they accept it, you then have more control. But of course you need to have a child account to go and do that. And you can also go and see history at the top right as well. And just to show you the Steam library, I'll click on library at the top. And now if I go and click on Euro Truck here, for example, I can go and install it from my Steam family library as another family member has it. So it's super useful. 